We take an interest in the basic human right of peaceful assembly and peaceful demonstration. Uh, this is a fundamental human right for all countries. And what we see in Taiwan, unfortunately, is that the people who are exercising their right for peaceful protest are being investigated, they're being, now they're being prosecuted and indicted. But what we don't see, and this is what we're most concerned about, is, the, uh, is we don't see the same standard applied to the violence that occurred here at the Executive Yuan on March 24th. We would like to see a complete investigation of every incident of violence that occurred on that night. And we think they are able to do so, and we are unhappy that they are apparently unwilling to do so. Who can deny that there were illegal acts that have been committed by the protesters? Should they not face up to this? People should face up to the illegal acts that they may or may not have done, okay? So we have a, we'll have a fair judicial process to determine this. But we are more concerned that there are no investigations on the other side. That's what we are concerned about. If everyone is investigated, that's fine. But why are they investigating only people on one side and not investigating people on the other side? That we cannot accept. If the person has, has, has only done a peaceful act, his charges should be dropped. He should not face criminal responsibility.